Hey guys, it's Vladit from the Tablet Guy, and today I'm gonna be reviewing an app called what's it called? Um, All-in-One Toolkit. <laughs> so, as the name says, it's an all-in-one toolkit. So you can see it right there. Let's see. And I'm actually gonna exit out of this. I've actually had a couple attempts at this video, but either the camera fell or something like that. So, what this app is, it's basically a toolkit for your tablet, like right here. If you want, you can actually read all that, but I'm actually just going to leave it on screen and then scroll through. Basically, what this does, right here, as you can see, it says RAM, which is random access memory. It means, like, the more RAM you have, the faster your device is going to run. And, oh my gosh, that flare. So, I actually have quite a bit fruit. what's it called, empty. As you can see right here, processor, oh, focus, 1,008 megahertz. So, I'm actually going to go on System Info. And if you want to know everything about your tablet, download this app and go on System Info. Basically, it has everything about your device. Like, but when I say everything, I actually say every, mean everything. Java Home slash System. Then Wi-Fi wi speeds and stuff, all that. So, this is basically the System Info part of it. Let's see what else. Ooh, Battery Boost right here. If you want to make your battery last longer, I'm not even sure if these actually work, but you can basically click the battery booster and then you can download it. Focus. If only my thing would focus. Thank you. There, you can just basically download the battery booster. Cancel real quick. Cancel that. Let's see what else is there. The ROM, which I'm not sure what that means, and SD card is basically the storage you have left. Processes, if you scroll over, basically this is all the processes you have running. And right here, you could actually hit kill selected. And let me quickly go back. As you can see, I have 16% of my RAM being used. But if I go right here, hit kill all right there. Kill selected. Bam, running process list is empty. And wow. Wait, free. I have 282 megabytes of RAM free. I'm thinking that the highlighted part is actually free since it f went up after I killed all the applications. So... Processes tools. This is basically um, things that you can actually do with it. Like cage cleaner, history cleaner. If you're on a phone, you could do call SMS cleaner. Basically cleans out like all the previous calls that left actually the memory behind. And then your SMS is if you want to actually clear it fast, you can just use that. Then what is this? SD card cleaner, APK cleaner, and what is this? App leftovers. Basically what app leftovers are is if you download an app and then like you deleted it, it might leave some memory behind. So, next, package manager. Batch install, batch uninstall. Sorry if it's not focusing well. It's probably the lighting. I'll try to fix that. Backup and restore. System app uninstall and app to SD. I'm not sure what that does. General. Add to startup, boost setup, and file manager. I actually use a different file manager. I'll actually cover that in a different video. Plugins. Basically, what plugins are... Is let's say you hit add plugins. What this does is, as you can see, there's all these different plugins. Let's say the first one add detect plugin helps to detect and plug in. What helps to detect add plugin app contains allows you to avoid all in ones from ads. I'm actually going to get that off camera, which is really awesome. Compass, flashlight, what is this? QR barcode scanner, quick settings, sensor detect. Basically, Anything you can actually want for a tablet. So guys, this was my review of the, what's it called? All-in-one toolkit. It is actually free on the Play Store. I'm not sure but if it's even on App Store. But hope you guys enjoyed the video. And please like, comment, and subscribe.